This is going to be a big announcement video for all CartFlow's customers and users. We're going to go over new features that are available now for you and what's coming very, very soon. It's very exciting, but before we get started, I want to go over our company's core values because it's going to help you to understand the decisions that we're making and what's driving these innovations inside of CartFlows. The very first core value is we strive to make everything simple and then easy to implement. Simple and easy are two very different concepts. And you're going to see this common theme throughout the new features that I'm going to show you in this video. Next, we are always ahead of the curve. We're thinking 24 months out into the future of what you're going to need. And we're working on all of that right now. And this is the vision that you'll be able to see through the features that I'm going to announce and show you in this video. Next, we are a customer center centric company. That means we're listening to you and what you're asking us for, and we want to deliver that to you. And lastly, we want to always be there for you to help you in any way that we can. And you see this through our help desk where we currently have our first response times down to about four hours. So this would be anytime that you reach out to us needing anything, we're going to get back in touch with you very, very quickly, regardless if it's the weekend or during the week, because we always strive to be there to support you. So I have two big features to share with you and show you. So the first big feature is dynamic offers. Let me explain to you what dynamic offers is, and then I'll show you it in action. Dynamic offers enables you to make relevant targeted offers based on what you know about your customer. Let me go ahead and show you how this works. Here's a course funnel that I created for some Photoshop training that I have. We have our checkout right here, and on this checkout, there's an order bump for live classes. However, I know that some buyers might need additional information or an extra incentive regarding pricing in order to buy my live classes. So I have it here as an order bump, but if someone does not accept that order bump, I want to make the offer a second time, but frame it a little bit differently and have a little bit different of pricing. So I also, though, if someone is on that checkout and does buy the live classes when it's an order bump, I don't want to offer them live classes again. Instead, I only want to offer those people one-on-one -on -one classes that come at a higher price point. So in this example, what I would know about the buyer is what they're buying. I would know if they purchase that order bump and what I want to do is skip the live classes altogether if they did buy the live classes already and send them directly to this other offer. Now, this is very easy to do with cart flows. So I'm first going to go into the settings for my checkout and I'll click right here where it says edit. You're going to see a new option here that says rules. I'll go ahead and click on that. And first, you would enable the feature by checking this box. And let's go ahead and review the rule that I have created. So what I'm doing is I want to redirect a buyer to the one on one classes upsell offer if these rules or conditions are true. Let me go ahead and expand this. So if the buyer has purchased my live classes already, I don't want to make that offer again. Let's go ahead and send them directly to the one on one offer. Now, our rules engine here for creating dynamic offers is very robust. There's multiple conditions you can choose, and these are basically the things that you know about a buyer. So it can be, I know what products they're buying. I know what product categories these products are in, if I've categorized them or if I've added tags to them. I know the total amount that they're spending on their initial purchase. I'll know if they use coupons, their shipping method, their payment method. I'll know their shipping country and their billing country. These are examples of information that we already know about them so that we can dynamically make that next offer for them. You can add additional conditions or separate 
separate conditions altogether. We do have a full tutorial video on using this new dynamic offers feature. And as you can see, this is going to enable you to make more targeted offers to your buyers, which will lead to additional revenue for your store. Now, the next big feature announcement is Canvas mode version one. This is truly the future of card flows and how you will build your funnels. Canvas mode enables you to build and manage your entire funnel visually. Let me show you how it works. Here I am back on my Photoshop course funnel. And just a moment ago, you saw me implement a dynamic offer inside of my funnel. Now, as my funnel gets larger and I add new steps and offers inside of it, it can begin to be complex. And at Cartflows, we want to make things simple, then easy. And that is what led us to build out canvas mode. So here is the typical view you would get for your funnel, but you're going to see a new tab right here that says canvas. I'll go ahead and click into it and as you can see it's a visual representation of my funnel and what is happening here so first I have an opt-in step then I have my checkout and connected to the checkout is a dynamic offer and it's in this rules group right here which I just showed you a moment ago so basically if someone was to buy this order bump I want to skip making that live offer again to them because they already purchased it. Instead, I want to send them straight on over to my one on one classes offer and then send them to the thank you page. However, if someone didn't buy the live classes, I want to make that offer again. And if they do choose to go with this, I want to send them up here to the one on one offer and then send them to the thank you page. This is a visual representation of everything that's going on. Let's go ahead and put this in full screen mode. I can click this icon right here. And now I have my canvas of my entire funnel in full screen. I can move these around. And if you notice, when you click on one, say the checkout, I have some options here. I can view the step on the front end. I can edit its design or I can go into its settings. So if I wanted to go into the settings for the checkout, I can simply click the settings wheel right here. A new tab opens up and now I'm in the settings for the checkout. And the same also happens for the rules that we're creating. I can click right here if I wanted to review them or make some changes or adjustments. I can click this little icon here. It's going to take me straight into the checkout right right into the rules that I just created. You can see I can move these around to better understand them. If I chose to, I can zoom in like here and I can zoom out by clicking on this minus icon. If I wanted to take the maximum space up, I can click this right here and it's going to fit everything to the screen that I have. And I can also lock all of this right here so I can't move these around. And if I wanted to get out of the full screen mode right here for canvas, I can tap on the escape key on my keyboard and it takes me right back here. Looks like I want to see everything. So I'll go ahead and click on this fit to screen option. And there we have, this is canvas mode. It's going to enable you to do everything visually. Now, just a moment ago, I said, this is canvas mode version one which you might be asking yourself, what does version one mean? With version one of canvas mode, we're automatically going to give you that visual representation of your funnel and you can manage your funnel right there and see everything that's going on. And I'm excited to announce that we're already working on version two of canvas mode, which is going to enable you to add steps, add upsells and downsells and connect the various steps together all visually as well. We're going to be working hard to bring everything into canvas mode. We also have plans of bringing your stats and analytics inside of canvas mode as well. So you can visually see how people are flowing through your funnels and how your offers are converting. At Cardflows, we're also working on an automation tool that we want to bring inside of canvas mode that will enable you to schedule emails, pass off buyer data via webhooks, 
and also via native APIs with email marketing platforms and also connect Cartflows with the core products that you use on your WordPress site, such as learning management plugins, membership plugins, and more. That's why I said earlier that Canvas mode is the future of funnel building in WordPress. So let me explain to you our release schedule, which I'm calling an extended beta period. And here is our beta plan. But first, let me explain that beta doesn't mean buggy. Beta means we're not yet ready for the full release of this. It's rock solid right now. We've been testing this internally on our own websites. So you can feel safe and confident using the beta on your website as well. So let me show you this beta plan that we have and why I'm calling it an extended beta plan. So beta one is going to have dynamic offers in Canvas version one. Beta one is available today inside of the members area on the Cartflows website. So you can download it today, upload it to your website and start taking advantage of dynamic offers and canvas mode in your business. Then we're going to be releasing beta two. Now beta two is going to bring dynamic offers to order bumps. If you noticed, I showed you dynamic offers as it related to one click upsells and downsells. However, we are going to be bringing this to order bumps. And there's also another feature we're going to release in beta two. I'm not yet ready to reveal what it is, but it's going to make using the global checkout replacement, that feature that Cartflows offers, a lot easier to get going on your website. Now, we're planning on releasing beta 2 in the middle of October, so just a few short weeks away. And then we're going to have beta three where we're going to be introducing a new modern checkout style, which will become the default checkout style for cart flows. Now, beta three will be released in early November. We're getting all of these features out to you intentionally before Black Friday because we want to give you every tool possible for you to have a blowout holiday sales season on your store. So that is the release schedule for this new exciting version of Cartflows. And to wrap it all up, I just want to thank you, our over 200,000 users. This November, Cartflows is going to be celebrating our third birthday. We've only been out for three short years. It's exciting. We have more passion than ever about Cartflows and making it the one essential plugin that every WooCommerce store must have on their website. Thank you for supporting us on this journey, and we're excited for what the future holds together.